it's cold again today. So today we're going to not be able to do a traveling video. Instead I'm going to bring you to uh, reloading ammunition. It's one of my hobbies that I've been doing for a long time. I've been doing it for about 40 years. Uh, what I'm going to introduce today to you is a new add-on feature. Actually, it's not new. It's been around for a while. It's just that a lot of people probably don't know about it. It's called a powder measure adapter. It allows you to replace the existing powder measure that the Dillon has on it that has a bar mechanism that goes side to side. Well, when you use extruded powders, what happens is that you don't always get a consistency on your powder dump. Uh, you could be as much as a half a grain off, uh, which is not really good because that can affect your accuracy quite a bit. So a lot of the precision shooters that shoot out there on the, on the range or do prairie dog shooting like myself that want to get that 500 yard shot accurate, uh, we have to load each round one by one and usually it takes a long time. So I'm going to show you how to uh, increase that time, make it a lot easier and more efficient so that you don't have to take so long to do it. So let's get into it. Okay, today I'm going to show you this device here. It's called a powder measure adapter. It comes from Dillon Precision. It also comes with a, with a little funnel. So what I'm going to do is, I took the powder mechanism off that comes from Dillon, the one with the bar, and we're going to slap this baby on. You got that like that, and then your funnel goes on like so. And now you're all set to go for hand measuring your powder. You just simply take your, your pan that comes off with your, your trickle charger, and just dump it into that little funnel and now every single load will be just where you want it. So I'm going to show you another device that will work with this. Okay, one thing bad about doing videos like uh, stuff like this is that you don't have a camera person or a camera guy to follow you around with the camera and zoom in on stuff and it makes it a little difficult but this is a real short video, it's not that long and I think I'll get the point across to you. But anyways, uh, this is a RCBS uh, powder dumper. Basically all you're going to do is you're going to take the uh, adapter and screw it onto the bottom and then you're going to stick it on top of your, your uh, 650 and then there's a little set screw you screw down on there and then you got your lever for simplicity and uh, I like this one better than the bar because it uh, it, it shears the uh, extruded powder when you pull the handle you can feel it shearing it off and then when you measure it in the container or in your shell you dump it into the, the, uh, the scale uh, most of the time I mean I should say probably 99.9% .9 of the time it's within one tenth of a grain, you know, plus or minus. I mean, that's not bad at all. And if you use a Dillon, I don't want to cut Dillon down or anything, but extruded powder does not work with a bar very well. You know, the one that goes side to side. It like fills up, and uh, for some reason, it might miss a couple little these little tiny pencil leads, and it doesn't really uh, measure real accurate. I mean, I've seen it as much as a half a grain off. And to me, that's not very well. I mean, I, I, would, I wouldn't go out with a bunch of rounds going out shooting prairie dogs with that because that's, that's just too much. You know, I like to get the powder dumps like right on target. So I don't even use this anymore. I've got a better way that I use now. And uh, I'll show you that, that device right now. And, then, and uh, but don't get me wrong, I mean, this is pretty good. I mean, you can you can probably do some pretty accurate loading, but you got to check your, your case each time, you know, and maybe every, every third one or something, and uh, it's, it's pretty consistent. 
you'd be amazed. So by using this adapter, it allows you to use uh, a Hornady, uh, RCBS, I don't know, Lyman might have one, but all the thread sizes are pretty much the same. So they'll screw into this adapter, so it'll make it pretty easy for you. So just check it out. Go on Dylan's, Dylan Precision's uh, website, and you'll find it. It's called the Powder Measure Adapter. And uh, I'm looking at it right now off the side of the camera here, and it's, uh, the price is $23.95. You know, and I'm sure there's a little shipping on that. So. All right, I'm going to show you what I use uh, for, for the way I get accurate uh, powder dumps. I got to go back camera, turn it off because I don't have a, a guy behind the camera. Okay, this is the uh, Hornaday's dispenser trickle charger. I'm just going to give you a sneak preview of it. I'm not going to go into detail. Uh, I just want to tell you that the time it takes to do a charge in there is anywhere from 15 seconds to about 35 seconds. It's very slick, does a very accurate job. It won't even uh, stop trickling until, until it hits that exact, exact point of 23 and a half grains if that's what you got dialed in for. Uh, you'll hear a beep and that tells you that it's done trickling. And like I said, uh, if you're running it through the Dillon 650 one at a time, uh, taking advantage of your case feeder up on top, you can run after everything is like you see my other videos with the uh, fastest way to prep brass. Once all the prepping is done, now you got a perfect shell that's trimmed to size and you have uh, no primer inside the shell. So when it comes down to shoot, you're going to prime it and then you're going to run it up to the powder dump and that die is going to be empty. It's not going to go around. So by putting that adapter in its place, that's going to allow you to use the funnel and then you can take the pan that's on this particular unit and then you dump it in the funnel and then I'll and then that's all you take all the worry out of it. It's all done. That's a perfect round. And then you follow through the next step and you put your bullet on top and run it up and uh, seat it and then you run it the next one and uh, so forth. So this is just a little sneak preview. Uh, I'm going to do probably a video on this and show you how this thing works, how you calibrate it, and how you do powder dumps with this one. Like I said, it, it's pretty slick. I thought it was going to be very slow when I bought it. And uh, it's, it's really pretty fast. I was really amazed on how fast it is. So, well, this is it. Hope you guys like it. Uh, hit the like button if you like it. And uh, if you want to see more of these videos, uh, the best thing to do is leave a lot of comments. I really appreciate that. And I see comments, it means uh, you guys like these videos. I found that uh, doing these type of videos uh, gets a lot more views than some of the other videos I've got. So uh, this time of year, I'm not uh, being able to do any traveling because i got to I gotta be on alert for snow plowing, so I can't go out of town too far. But we do have a uh, thing coming up. It's called Sky Circus on Ice. We're gonna be doing that in a couple weeks, and I'll be posting that video. So you guys have a great day, and uh, please subscribe to my channel here, and uh, you'll be able to see all the videos that I've got. So thanks a lot for watching. I really appreciate it, and I'm signing off. And you guys all have a great day.